Welcome to Regobot Organic Farm. Today I am going to show how to manage muskmelon plants once they start setting fruit and the insects and the pests start affecting the fruit. Here you can see the fruit is infected and it's not in a usable condition. If you identify a fruit infected like this, you should know that the fruit borer insects are there in the area and more fruits would have been affected like this. And it's very hard to get rid of this once it starts spreading. This infected fruit should be removed and buried under the soil. The fruit fly is a serious threat to the flowers. The female flies pierce the skin of the fruit and lay at least 700 eggs at a time. Not only the fruits, it also affects the vegetables such as chili, pepper, tomatoes, brinjal, okra. The only solution is to combine all forms of fruit fry trapping method to reduce and control the fruit fight population in the orchard. In this video, we will look at the different types of fruit traps hanging in the orchard. The chemical used in the fruit trap is methyl eugenol and it smells like a female fly. This smell attracts the male flies to the fruit trap from at least 100 meters or even more. The chemical inside the trap kills the male fly and they will not be able to mate. And without mating, the female flies will not be able to lay eggs. Next was the solar pest trap. The solar light has a battery inside it get charged during daytime. During night, the solar lights are switched on and the harmful insects that are roaming around in the night are attracted towards the light. Water and kerosene mix is there in the plate and the insects fall and die in the plate. Next is the magic sticker chromatic trap. With this trap, we can protect the crops from insects such as leaf hoppers, capsids, shore flies, white flies, brown plant hopper, diamondback mold, leaf miners, fungus jams, onion flies, cucumber beetles, jacids, frog hopper, and more. Another method of pest control is the use of pheromone traps. Pheromone is a biological substance released by the female insects to attract the males. Pheromones are specific to each species of insects. The traps are fitted like this on the fields at 2 to 3 feet above the crops. 5 pheromone traps are enough for an acre. The male insects are attracted towards the polybags and die in the traps. Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, subscribe my channel and share the video in social media.